Chapter 1 A Quiet Life in the Countryside In the serene countryside of rural China, where the whispers of the wind danced through fields of golden wheat and the fragrance of wildflowers perfumed the air, there resided a thirty-year-old woman named Li Mai. Hers was a life shaped by the gentle rhythms of nature, where each day unfolded like a chapter in a timeless tale of simplicity and resilience. Born into a world where hardship was as common as the morning dew, Li Mai knew the weight of poverty all too well. Raised in a small village nestled amidst rolling hills and meandering streams, she learned from an early age the value of hard work and perseverance. Her parents, simple farmers with hearts as vast as the skies above, instilled in her the virtues of humility and resilience, teaching her to find beauty in the smallest of things and strength in the face of adversity. But amidst the challenges that life in the countryside presented, there was always a beacon of light that illuminated Li Mai's path, her loyal companion, Xiao Bai. A canine friend with fur as white as freshly fallen snow and eyes that sparkled with boundless curiosity, Xiao Bai had been by Li Mai's side since he was a mere pup. Together, they traversed the sprawling fields and winding trails that crisscrossed the countryside, their footsteps echoing the rhythm of their hearts as they embarked on countless adventures. To Li Mai, Xiao Bai was more than just a pet, he was her steadfast companion, her confidant, and her closest friend. In moments of joy, he was there to share in her laughter, his tail wagging with unbridled enthusiasm as they chased butterflies through fields of blooming wildflowers. And in times of sorrow, he offered solace in the form of a gentle nuzzle or a comforting paw, his unwavering presence a balm for her weary soul. Together, they roamed the countryside, their spirits intertwined like the vines that climbed the ancient trees that dotted the landscape. In the quiet moments of the early morning, as the first light of dawn painted the sky in shades of pink and gold, Li Mai would often find herself lost in contemplation, her thoughts drifting like the clouds that drifted lazily overhead. And beside her, always, was Xiao Bai, his warm gaze a silent reassurance that she was never truly alone. In the tranquil embrace of the countryside, Li Mai found solace amidst the chaos of the world beyond. Here, amidst the rustling leaves and the gentle hum of insects, she discovered a sense of peace that eluded her elsewhere, a sanctuary where the worries of the world faded into insignificance against the backdrop of nature's grandeur. And as she stood on the threshold of a new day, with Xiao Bai by her side and the promise of adventure beckoning on the horizon, Li Mai knew that no matter what trials lay ahead, as long as she had her loyal companion at her side, she would always find the strength to endure. Chapter 2 A Mother's Illness The tranquility of Li Mai's world shattered one fateful day when a shadow of illness descended upon her home. It began with a subtle cough, a fleeting weakness that soon morphed into a relentless fever that refused to abate. With each passing day, Li Mai watched helplessly as her mother's strength waned, her once vibrant spirit dimming like a flickering candle in the wind. In the face of this looming tragedy, Li Mai knew that she could not afford to falter. With no one else to turn to, she took on the mantle of caregiver with a fierce determination born of love and duty. From the moment the first light of dawn painted the sky, until the stars glittered overhead like diamonds in the velvet night, Li Mai tended to her mother's every need with unwavering devotion. The days blurred together in a haze of exhaustion and anxiety as Li Mai navigated the treacherous waters of illness with a steady hand and a heavy heart. She cooked nourishing meals with ingredients gleaned from their meagre pantry, each dish infused with love and hope for her mother's recovery. She administered medicine with a gentle touch, her fingers trembling with fear as she prayed for a miracle to ease her mother's suffering. But amidst the chaos of caregiving, 
Li Mai never once allowed herself to succumb to despair. With each passing day, she drew strength from the memory of her mother's resilience, her unwavering faith in the face of adversity serving as a beacon of hope in the darkest of times. And by her side, offering silent support in his own canine way, was Xiao Bai, his presence a source of comfort amidst the turmoil that engulfed their home. As the weeks stretched into months, Li Mai's days became a blur of ceaseless activity as she juggled the demands of caregiving with the responsibilities of farm work and household chores. And yet, despite the overwhelming weight of her burdens, she refused to waver in her duty to her mother. For in the quiet moments of the night, when the world lay hushed beneath a blanket of stars, Li Mai found solace in the knowledge that her love was the greatest gift she could offer her mother in her time of need. And so, she pressed on, her footsteps echoing the rhythm of her heart as she navigated the uncertain path that lay before her. For in the crucible of adversity, Li Mai discovered a strength she never knew she possessed, a resilience forged in the fires of love and sacrifice. And though the road ahead was fraught with challenges, she walked it with unwavering determination, her unwavering devotion to her mother guiding her every step of the way. Chapter 3 The Strength Within As the days stretched into weeks, and the weeks into months, Li Mai found herself tested in ways she could never have imagined. The weight of her mother's illness bore down upon her shoulders like a burden too heavy to bear, threatening to crush her spirit beneath its relentless weight. And yet, in the crucible of adversity, Li Mai discovered a wellspring of strength that lay dormant within her, waiting to be unleashed in her darkest hour. It was a strength born not of physical might, but of love, a love so fierce and unwavering that it became the driving force behind every action, every sacrifice. It was a love that transcended words, a silent pact forged in the depths of her heart that bound her to her mother and to Xiao Bai with unbreakable bonds. In moments of doubt and despair, it was Xiao Bai who stood by Li Mai's side, his warm gaze a silent reassurance that she was never truly alone. Together, they weathered the storm of uncertainty, their spirits intertwined like the roots of an ancient tree, drawing strength from each other in their darkest moments. With each passing day, Li Mai found herself drawing upon this reservoir of strength with a quiet determination that belied her youth. She cooked and cleaned, tended to her mother's needs with a tenderness born of love, and carried out her duties on the farm with a steadfastness that spoke volumes of her resilience. And through it all, she refused to succumb to the darkness that threatened to engulf her. For in the depths of her soul, she knew that her love for her mother and for Xiao Bai was a light that would guide her through even the darkest of nights. As the seasons changed and the world around her transformed, Li Mai stood tall amidst the chaos, her spirit unyielding in the face of adversity. And though the road ahead was fraught with challenges, she walked it with unwavering courage, her heart filled with the knowledge that the strength she sought lay not in the world around her, but within the depths of her own being. Chapter 4 A Beacon of Kindness In the heart of adversity, amidst the trials and tribulations that beset Li Mai and her mother, there burned a flame of compassion that illuminated the darkest corners of their world. Despite their own hardships, they remained steadfast in their commitment to kindness, offering whatever little they had to those who crossed their path in need. Li Mai and Xiao Bai, united in their unwavering devotion to each other and to their community, became beacons of light in a world shrouded in darkness. Together, they extended a hand of friendship to those who had lost their way, offering food, shelter, and solace to weary travellers and desperate souls alike. Their acts of kindness were simple yet profound, rippling outward like the gentle waves of a pond, touching the lives of their neighbours and reaffirming the power of compassion in even the darkest of times. 
whether it was sharing their meager harvest with a hungry family or offering a listening ear to a troubled soul, Li Mai and Xiao Bai never hesitated to lend a helping hand to those in need. Their generosity knew no bounds, transcending the boundaries of wealth and status to embrace all who sought their aid. In a world torn apart by strife and division, they stood as a shining example of the transformative power of love and compassion, reminding their community that even in the bleakest of times, there is always hope. And as they continued to spread acts of kindness like seeds scattered upon the wind, Li Mai and Xiao Bai witnessed the miraculous power of their actions as they took root and blossomed into moments of grace and beauty. For in the end, they knew that it was not wealth or power that defined a person's worth, but the depth of their compassion and the kindness of their heart. And so, they walked the path of kindness with unwavering resolve, their spirits buoyed by the knowledge that even the smallest acts of generosity could illuminate the darkest of nights. For in a world hungry for love and understanding, Li Mai and Xiao Bai were beacons of hope shining brightly amidst the shadows, their light guiding the way for all who dared to follow. Chapter 5 A Journey of Hope As the seasons turned and the sun traced its arc across the sky, a subtle shift began to take hold in the tranquil countryside where Li Mai and Xiao Bai resided. It was a change imperceptible to the casual observer, yet palpable in the air, a whisper of hope, a promise of renewal that stirred the very depths of Li Mai's soul. With each passing day, Li Mai watched with bated breath as her mother's strength slowly returned, like a dormant seed unfurling its tender shoots in the warmth of spring. Though weary from the long months of caregiving, Li Mai felt a profound sense of gratitude wash over her, like a gentle rain that quenched the thirst of her parched spirit. In the crucible of adversity, she had discovered not only her own strength, but also the boundless capacity of the human heart to love, to endure, and to overcome. It was a revelation that filled her with a sense of awe and wonder, like a traveller stumbling upon a hidden oasis in the midst of a vast desert. With each tentative step towards recovery, Li Mai's mother became a beacon of hope, her resilience a testament to the indomitable spirit of the human soul. And as the shadows of illness receded and the light of healing flooded their home once more, Li Mai found herself filled with a sense of purpose that transcended the confines of her own existence. For she knew that the journey they had embarked upon was not just a test of endurance, but a pilgrimage of the heart, a quest for meaning and redemption in a world fraught with uncertainty and despair. And though the road ahead was long and fraught with challenges, Li Mai walked it with renewed determination, her spirit buoyed by the knowledge that she was not alone. For by her side, through every trial and tribulation, stood Xiao Bai, his unwavering loyalty a constant source of comfort and strength. Together, they forged ahead, their footsteps echoing the rhythm of their hearts as they embraced the promise of a brighter tomorrow. As the seasons changed and the world around them transformed, Li Mai looked to the future with renewed hope and optimism. For she knew that no matter what challenges lay ahead, she would face them head-on, armed with the courage of her convictions and the unwavering loyalty of her beloved companion, Xiao Bai. And so, they journeyed forth into the unknown, their hearts filled with the promise of new beginnings and the steadfast belief that no matter how dark the night may seem, the dawn of a new day is always waiting to greet them with open arms.